Hey guys, welcome back to Rad Rob Gaming. Here's Rad Rob. We're gonna be challenging Tiger again. Let's see what happens, right? Oh, it's time for the old something classic at Marina something or other. I don't want to know. I'm uh, I gotta get into the groove. Two K Sports, in association sports. with the PGA Tour, proudly presents the season-long race for the FedEx Cup. Today's coverage of the Daybreak Classic is about to begin. Pleased you could join us for this first round action. I'm Luke Elvey alongside Rich Beam in the booth, and it's a hello to Henny Koyak down on the course following our featured group. Thanks, Luke. Hi, Rich. Yeah, there will be fireworks out there today. Let me tell you, these two players have been going back and forth at each other on social media. They have something to prove out on this golf course today. Well, Henny, I'm a little jumpy in my seat and I can already see the man beside me sniggering. Rich Bean knows he's taken down Tiger once in his life, but I think it was only once. Luke, please, please, please don't get Rich out of his box. Once we do that, we can't put him back in. Although, I will give him that he's done it. He's shown that Tiger can be beaten, but come on. <sighs> Will it be done today? It's Tiger Woods. Well, that's the question we're going to get answered, aren't we? Very few people have ever laid claim to beating Tiger head to head. Good luck in your rivalry. You're going to need it. And Henny, what's he looking at here? Well, I wouldn't mind hitting the shot, but I wouldn't fancy the walk up here. This is quite uphill. And here we are with the third shot. How close that's was that to going in? in? Just six feet between here and the hole. Looking good. Well, that'll maintain the momentum. Nice par putt. That's a rock solid par right there. He finds himself going to for now. Stay there. Let's see what happens here on the second hole. This looks to be heading to the green. A wonderful Perfect. shot and a chance for Purdy here at the second. Why don't we catch up with our man in the hot seat, Tiger Woods? He's just coming off a drop shot on that last hole. Well, a little off the target with that one. Well, he tried to fade it in there, but just didn't commit to it. Butting for birdie. Hey, that's a chance. Yeah, nice mid-range birdie putt, that one. Currently one under for the day. And the third hole here at Old Marina Golf Club uh, looks very familiar, Rich. Par four, playing 444 yards. Luke, if you're a fan of Pebble Beach Golf Links, you're absolutely going to love this hole. Just 444 yards for the back tees. Driver really isn't necessary as there is out of bounds over on the right-hand side that comes into play in a hurry. Just avoid the bunkers on the left-hand side. Uh. Find the fairway. Second shot plays slightly uphill. It actually looks like an infinite edge pull. It's really difficult to judge distance control with that second shot. Still a great hole, one that you'd dearly love to make birdie on. Currently one under for the tournament. This hole is a par five. Oh, I've been in the water so many times here. Gotta say, just some of the best rhythm in the game. Time for the second shot here at the four. Opting for the hybrid, I think. All right, we're going with an extra club here. Now heading over to Tiger Woods. He's two strokes behind his rival this week. Wow, what a save. And now this is why you can never get comfortable, even if you're leading a PGA Tour Pro. This is what they do. They mean business. Ah, that's frustrating. And this putt to move into second spot on the leaderboard, or at least a share of it. Now three strokes back after that hole. Time to play one of the one-shotters. Going with the 9-iron, I think. Well, that's beautifully judged. This one here, this is for back-to-back -back birdies, moving him in the right direction. Didn't quite judge the speed. Oh, uh, I feel you, brother. Four feet to the cup. Now, that's got to be frustrating. Hit such a great approach shot in, but wasn't able to convert. Yep. Welcome to the tee of a par four. Looks like they got all of that one. That's on a good line. 
Second shot here on the sixth. Chosen the pitching wedge here. Oh, they're dialed in. It's an absolute clinic. It's amazing to see how good this player is in full flow. Didn't that look good for a long time? And back to the course with the live action. Be nice to see this one go down. Let's see if they make it. Trailing by a couple of strokes now. Left nothing in the tank on that one. That was pummeled. This shot here near the 200 yard marker. Just two shots behind. I wish I would have won so far. Such sort of a good shot, that dude. One. Not quite inside the booty range, but you never know. Hold a long one. Still counts. That's great golf there. Almost an eagle. Why don't we catch up with what Tiger Woods is up to? Now, who'd have thought we'd see this? He is behind his rival. Can he do the catching up that's necessary? And after that effort, let's take a look at how it stands. The leader now has a one-stroke advantage. It's time for a one-shotter. Looks like they've got the five wood. Why don't we catch up with our man in the hot seat, Tiger Woods? Yeah, he just made bogey on that last one. Well, that looks to be drawing back nicely. This would be a great up and down from this spot. <laughs> Came close on that one. Well played. And if this can go down, he'll save par. Just one off the lead after that hole. The ninth hole here, though, at Old Marina Golf Club is a strong one. A really tough test to fit. Oh, just absolutely abused the golf ball there with that shot. Sitting at minus four in second place. That's nicely done. A lot on the line here. This putt for a share of top spot. Surely it's going to. Uh. Uh, a bit long on that one. All right, Henny. What's he got in front of him here with this putt? Setting up this putt nine feet from the car. Come on. So far, so good, but it's only early days, Rich, in this rivalry. Up early on their rival, which is exactly where you want to be, but a lot of golf still to go until the end of the tournament. And what are we looking at here, Henny? They're setting up this next shot into quite an elevated green, Luke. This one looks to be a tad wayward. Good shot there, Beamer. Getting ready to play their third. Just one stroke back and right in it. Oh, I thought that one was going in. An opportunity here to move into a tie for first. Yep, nice to make a mid-range par putt. Nicely played. Moving on up the leaderboard now after that hole. Teeing off here at the 11th. Now heading over to Tiger Woods. He's currently trailing his rival. Let's see what happens here. Always a joy to see Tiger Woods. Here he is in action. A wonderful shot. A chance for Bernie here on the 11th. Now, four under par. Currently tied for top spot. Going with the pitching wedge here. Ooh, just skin the hole, that one. A chance to move to five under par. This is on a great line. And racking up their fifth birdie of the day. And with that, he'll move to five under par. Oh, back. And still in top spot after that hole. Keep it going. And an opportunity awaits as they step onto this tee of the par three.
Looks oh. to be going with the six iron. Uh, I'm not sure that's what they had in their mind. That's further right than they wanted. Wow, that almost went in the hole. Oh, fucking rolling, dude. And Henny, what are they looking at here? The perfect leave. Uphill can be firm. Just three feet to the cup. Currently four under for the event. This hole is a long par four. And that's a nice strike. This one should find the fairway. And this shot from about 150 yards out. He's currently tied for the lead. Handy effort, that one. Always nice to have a birdie putt. Well played. And that will take him to five under. And with that, he's now broken the tie, all alone at the top of the leaderboard. I'm pretty sure this player will be buoyed by that birdie back at the last. Let's see if they can deliver another one. This one should find the rough. What kind of shot are they facing here, Henny? Yeah, I think he's got around 135. This needs just a little work really, to the left-hand side. Yeah. Not a bad shot, that. Still a chance. Why don't we catch up with what Tiger Woods is up to? He's happy, just came off a birdie. Oh, Excellent. that was a beauty. This is one of those lengthy putts. Good one just to get close. Little birdie look in here. It was on a good line. Three feet to go here to the hole. Yeah, nothing to sweat over that one. We'll hold. Let's see what happens here on the 15th. Come on, look after us. Little bounce to the right here. Yes, any time you can find the green and have a putt, you'll take it. Oh. Yeah, that's lovely weight. Getting it right, right up line. the hole. Excellent job. Why don't we catch up with our man in the hot seat, Tiger Woods? Now, who'd have thought we'd see this? He is behind his rival. Can he do the catching up that's necessary? No, he can't. So, after that effort, this is what the leaderboard looks like. Time to see what this par four has in store. Do you attack it and try and increase your lead, or do you lay back and play safe? I like to attack it. What do they like to do? Attack. That was a little untidy, wasn't it? Henny, I'm sure you've got a better look of that lie. He is not going to like this one bit. This is what bad lies are made of. Trying to get to six under now with this putt. Oh, what a round this is. Seven birdies to Finally play. made one of those. And that will move him to six under par. <clears throat> Currently in first position. Well, Rich, don't know about you, but my eyes are wide open standing here on the 17th tee of the Old Marina Golf Club. Every player is going to be salivating to get here. This could be the easiest hole by a long shot on this golf course. The fairway, massive, most generous fairway out here. Second shot, a little bit uphill, but let's face it, just 506 yards, slightly uphill. I promise you, every player in this field is thinking eagle and nothing but. Break. Just didn't drop. A I chance for a booty if this goes down. This one's looking good. Unbelievable. And that should secure the par on this one. Unbelievable. That now was the fucking easiest. It was the easiest fucking shot. It's feeling good. Just birdied the last hole. Well, nicely done. Holds the putt for back-to-back -back birdies. Two in a row there, Luke. Getting their groove on. Now striding to the final tee of this round. That's heading for the fairway. Sitting at six under for the day. They currently share the lead in this one. Oh, well played. Oh, this will be a bonus. Right on 17 feet from here. 
Ouch, that hurts. Why well, don't mind this part, putt? All right, good first round. Finishing the round with a tap in. And as this round winds down, he finishes in a tie for the lead. Well, right, that'll just about do it. On behalf of there. Rich Beam, I'm Luke Elvey. Thanks for tuning in. Look forward to your company next time. Sports and the PGA Tour are delighted to bring you the season-long race for the FedEx Cup. Today's coverage of the Daybreak Classic is about to begin. Pleased you could join us for this second round action. I'm Luke Elvey alongside Rich Beam and this player starts their round in the lead. How should they approach today? Yes, right now the game plan is working but they still have to go out there and play off the front foot, play on offense and not worry about who's chasing them. Today is promising to be an exciting one. So let's get straight into the action. Yeah, that'll work. That's fine. This is a good chance. Oh, gee, that line was looking good, just wasn't it? Go home. That's your so home. it'll be a part of the start there, Will. Nothing wrong me. with an opening part, just easing their way into this round. Time to tee off at the second. Oh, this one should find the surface. Good shot, this. Okay, Henny, what's he looking at with this putt? 15 feet out. He's been staring this one down. This is what they have left for birdie here. And with that hole, this player is currently tied for first with Brooke Henderson. Always like to see your name moving up the leaderboard. Never a bad thing. I'd be booking Whoops. in for some lessons if I was swinging it like that. Second shot here on the third. See if we can make this big putt for birdie. Yeah, that looked to be a bit of a misread. A bit. And down it goes. Let's head to the next. Why don't we catch up with what Tiger Woods is up to? He's currently trailing his rival. Let's see what happens here. And after that effort, this is how the leaderboard looks. This hole is a par five. Yeah, you hit a beauty, didn't you? Penny, what have they got in front of them here? Setting up here from about 195 yards. They've decided to club up. Now, this wind really starting to get up. That was well managed. Just nine feet remaining to the hole. Oh, just Gotta missed. make those. It's a fucking beautiful, beautiful opportunity. Oh, how about that one? And Just that will take him to that, seven man. under. Why don't we catch up with our oh man in the hot seat, Tiger textbook. Woods? Now, who'd have thought we'd see this? He is behind his rival. Can he do the catching up that's necessary? Teeing off here at the fifth. Going with the eight iron here. Yep, that shot safely on the green. What are we looking at for this putt, Henny? Straight back up this hill. Can be firm here. Oh, Opportunity to make their par. Now heading over to Tiger Woods. He's currently trailing his rival. Just Let's see what it. happens here. Oh, Rich! How good is that? That's incredible! What an outstanding bunker shot. What a play. Great shot. Nicely done. Our current leader is enjoying a one-shot lead. Let's see what happens here on the sixth. And Henny, what's he looking at here? Setting up here from about 140 yards. Nice out the rough here. And here we are with the third shot. Currently a shot off the lead. 
Well, that's very crafty, isn't it? Oh, Dr. Chapinski strikes again. And just keeping it in neutral on the leaderboard. Love the long holes. Welcome to the par five. Playing this shot from about 230 yards out. Just one stroke back in this tournament. Well, that's a tremendous shot and sets up a wonderful opportunity. I tell you what, what a sensational play. This player stepped up their game, a bold play, hopefully a bold reward. And this putt is to move into a share for the lead. That's a lovely putt to make for Birdie. Take some pride in that one. And that will take him to eight under. We've reached the eighth hole. Going with the hybrid. Nicely done. <clears throat> Why don't we catch up with what Tiger Woods is up to? Now, who'd have thought we'd see this? He is behind his rival. Can he do the catching up that's necessary? No, he can't. Not the Tiger of old. Kenny, you've had the chance to have a look over this one? Setting up this putt 27 feet from the cup. This for back-to-back -back birdies. Really thought I had that. And that should secure the par on this one. Tree shadows. Trailing by a stroke okay. after that hole. And now we find ourselves with a par four here. For those who like to work the golf ball from left to right, you're gonna have to take a little bit of a chance by aiming over that hazard on the left-hand side. But if you find the fairway, boy, I tell you what, that's a fantastic feeling because this hole has got so much beauty. I love the second shot, the bunkers on the front, but I love how the green runs away on the left-hand side. The design of this hole, Ooh, especially the green, is absolutely amazing. That's what I get for talking shit. This putt is of nine feet. Hang on, this looks pretty handy. Oh, that had eyes for a Need that. shot. And just with nine holes remaining, Rich, what do you think here is going to happen for this player? Well, Luke, it's been fun watching this player duke it out with their rival, that's for sure. They're winning the rivalry thus far. Should be fun to see where these two end up at the end of the event. This one looks to be slightly offline here. Getting ready to play their third. Just one shot back now. <laughs> made it. And that will move him up the leaderboard as well. Well, that's worth reviewing. Let's roll the videotape. Now look how they attacked this one. Currently at 10 under par overall. Time to tee off on the 11th. Beautiful swing there. And Henny, what kind of a shot are they facing this time? You're going to need one or two clubs more because this green is sitting up. Our man on the ground, John, he's down there. What's the news? Hey guys, we are checking in here with Brooke Henderson as she gets set for her next shot here on the 12th. Okay, let's get back to it, shall we? 11 feet left to the hole. Looking better. Mark it down. That's birdie number five. That was big. He's currently in a They're keeping pace with me. I mean, this is the shit now. ourselves on a par three here. Going with the six iron here. Ugh. Trying to move to 12 under par with this putt. This is their look at birdie. Didn't quite have the right stuff there. And there it is. Now leading by one shot. Here we find ourselves on the tee of a long par four. Yeah, give yourself a pat on the back. What kind of shot are they facing here, Henny? I can see the 125 yard marker just nearby. Wow, that one was a fairway splitter. Let's catch up with Tiger Woods. Gee, that'll keep the momentum rolling, Rich. Saving one there after being all over the parking lot, chipping it for the par. Eight feet to the cup. Okay, yeah. steady now. Putting for par. 
Well, it was a wonderful approach shot, wasn't it? But unfortunately, having to settle for par. Next up is this two shot hole. That's not the one he wanted. Time for the second shot at the 14th. Well, safe on the surface. Maybe it's time to hold a long range bomb. That'll sting a bit. That will drive you bats. Why don't we catch up with our man in the hot seat, Tiger Woods? He's currently trailing his rival. Let's see what happens here. Ooh, that almost went down. So after that effort, this is the current standings on the course. The leader now has a one-stroke advantage. <clears throat> well, let's get amongst this 15th hole. And after a par at the last, a chance to perhaps signal some intent. Ah. to have opted for the eight iron. Wow. A bit wild on approach there. Not too sure what happened there. That's a very uncharacteristic mistake. What's in front of them, Henny? Setting up this part 10 feet from the cup. Ooh. This one's for bogey. Well, the leader giving a little hope for the rest of the field there as they put down a bogey on the scorecard. Trying to shake off the bogey on the last hole as they step onto this tee. How is he going to play this? Lay back or go for it and extend his lead. Second shot here on the 16th. That a boy. Good shot. 18 feet to the cup. That was a Dang it. Attempt. Putting for a par here. Now heading over to Tiger Woods. Birdied their last hole. Here's Tiger Woods. How close was that to going down? And now we can take a look at how that play affects the leaderboard. This hole is a par five. Every player is going to be salivating to get here. This could be the easiest hole by a long shot on yeah, this golf I course. It up. The fairway, massive, most generous fairway out here. Second shot, a little bit uphill, but let's face it, just 506 yards, slightly uphill. I promise you, every player in this field is thinking eagle and nothing but. Is that me? Why don't we catch up with what Tiger is up to? Now, who'd have thought we'd see this? He is behind his rifle. Arr. Can he do the catching up that's necessary? Try to get to 11 under with this putt. Rolling end to end, this looking nice. And that putt will give the save that. number six on the day. And after that hole, he's no longer sharing top spot. He's at the summit all alone. Well, it's come down to this, the final hole. Welcome to the 18th. Bounce. Playing this shot from about 180 yards. Currently in the lead by a shot. Opting for the six iron. This one looks like it will safely Perfect. make the green. This player showing zero signs of any nerves as they play against their rival and playing partner, Tiger Woods. What a fantastic approach. Good finish. And that will do it for this player today. Yeah, Rich, that was a nerve-wracking day. It was tense, it's wasn't it? it. Drama-filled and a tight lead to end it. Tell you what, Luke, there could be massive fireworks tomorrow with this player. Slender lead. Are they going to be able to get a good night's sleep tonight? I'm not so sure. I will. Don't worry. Well, that's all we... Guys, thumbs up, sub to my channel, follow me on Instagram and Twitter, at RadRabGaming. We'll see you in the next one for final two rounds. Thanks for watching. Take care.